Okay, here we are. So we drove around for like 20 minutes trying to figure out what we wanted to eat and we finally decided on Metro hey, Diner. Hi. Hi. <laughs> can I get you all the drink? <laughs> um, can I start with water with no ice please? Okay. Can I have a sweet tea? Okay. Yeah, so we didn't know where to go so we thought, okay, okay, diner food, like breakfast and lunch is all there. And we've heard good things about Metro Diner so we thought we would try. And here we are. Yeah, I I think I'm gonna get breakfast, but I gotta look. I also heard they have good gluten-free options here. Hopefully. Our waitress seems scared of the camera, so maybe we won't record her. Okay, you go first. Okay, um, can I please get the two egg breakfast? Okay. I'll have my eggs sunny side. Hash browns, um, gluten-free toast. And turkey sausage. Yeah, I can Alright, sweetie, you ready? Um, yes. I do. So, Mom. Yes. Adrian's been trying really hard to find people that want to start going to the gym with us so we can have a workout crew. Oh, mm, how's your team? Not that good. It was just not a flavor I was expecting. It looks normal. I think it's like box. Yeah. I mean, this place is jumping. I have no idea. There's a lot of people who come in by themselves. Okay, I'm gonna try to go to the bathroom and see what's like in there. I never do bathroom updates. Here we are, inside of the Metro Diner women's bathroom, as you can see, there is only one stall. It's fairly clean, I mean, it's busy right now, but it looks nice in here. Employees must wash hands, how cute. <laughs> Unlike the bathroom, it's not clean out here. Can you see, there's combs, this is dirty. Diners are often like that though, so. We're gonna try to let it go. Cause that's that's regular diner style. Be crummy, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Hopefully the food will come soon. Molly, what's your say? All of these are different. A must go for brunch. What's your say? So good. Excellent service too. I can no longer live without strawberry butter. Really their first mistake was putting us near the door. If I saw me coming, I wouldn't put me near the door. I'd put me back at the nice table in the corner. I'm clearly going to tell everyone. I can smell, smell like someone smoking a black outside. It's very appetizing. But locals eat here and locals smoke, so I should be accommodating. My food's here. Let's look at it. the yolks. Can't judge your breakfast until you break the yolk. Ready! Yeah. Mm. It's really quite a lot of hash browns. Can you see? Massive amount. There's no way I can eat all that. I'm not really sure why anyone would be given that many hash browns. I mean, I'm gonna try. Pepper! I guess we should start our shopping at Target since we're here. Oh, Right, I know. We're gonna go to Target. Hide your wallet. No, I won't buy too much there though because, you know, Target is expensive. I'm aware of this. For no reason sometimes, you know. Hey, how's everything? 
The manager just stopped by to ask us how we were doing. He's clearly fucked up on something. I knew it. He's on drugs. Definitely. And that's the reputation this place has. I mean, it didn't matter. I could just tell. Like, he was doing a little too much. What do we think he did? Not an upper. No. He sh that's what he should have done. If he was going to do drugs at work. Like heroin or something. Yeah, yeah. Like some sort of methamphetamine. <laughs> My sausage is undercooked. People don't know how to handle turkey, I feel like. That side looks good. That size is not. I shall butter mine the etiquette way, which is where you rip off one small piece and just butter that little tiny piece every time you want to eat it for some reason. I am going to eat the butter. Yeah. Your this has seeds in it. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Well, I was short in order, so I just split your order. Oh, okay. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> That's what she meant. I didn't realize. Yeah, I didn't know what was happening. It's like a hectic. Yep. I don't know how to do here, so I didn't want to question her. I'm trying to guess the brand. Let's eat the hot one. Um, it's fairly big. It's not like Wheaties or something. I mean, it tastes better than that. Oh, it's I don't know what brand this is actually. It's not one of the ones that I have had at my house. Yeah, it's definitely gluten free. This is a good gluten free bread for a diner. That's one of the ways Denny gets me. Denny's gets me is because they have gluten free English muffins. Which means that you can get like a bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich like normal. I feel like, even though I lift so much, this my neck still isn't as defined as when I did ballet a lot. I guess we just came during the rush because everyone's leaving now. It came really late though. You're right, I'm a heathen. I cut up all my food, then I eat it. I know, it's not right. I have taken etiquette class more than once. I know it's wrong. This is the type of place where people let their babies cry. Like, I need to remember to leave my card on the table here. Anywhere I record, I need to leave my card. The waiter probably wants to see herself. And the mean things we say about her. JK, JK. Who even is our server anymore? I'm not sure. All right, all right. I put my card in the little thing. I'll give it to the waiter, too. I'm really full. I'm already full. We'll have to wait till we get in the car, do our full review. We can't be that mean in front of these people. But there's a fly right there. And he's eating some crumbs, because there's a lot of crumbs. Let's just say, I can be almost sure we will not be returning. Maybe if there is a power outage and this is the only place open. And Maybe we, have we could try another, another location. location. So far, I prefer Denny's. Partially because I love Denny's, but also because, I don't know, I'm going to go to a random diner. I may as well pay half of this money. <laughs> this is meal that Denny's is for like four ninety nine. <laughs> you want to see what? There's seeds in it. There are seeds. Is that normal? Yeah, it's strawberry and strawberry jam. Eat it with meat jam. 
I like strawberry jam, I just don't like seeds. Jam evaluation time with Molly. This one's fine. Are seeds good or bad? I mean, strawberries have seeds. My mom used to make damson jam. What's that now? Oh no, there are berries at my grandmother's house. Oh! I guess they were damsons. Okay, okay, that's enough up here. We're almost done eating. After this, we're gonna probably go to Target and then some other places. I need to get a few things. Yeah. Okay, I just remembered. We always forget to look at the reviews on Google of the places we eat at so we can see if other people agree with us. Metro Dana. Mine has 1,000 reviews at my point. How do I know if this is the Oh, 33 feet? That's the one I'm at. All right, so it looks like 4.5 stars, 635 reviews. People love this place. What in the, no, I think people at Shore Pump are more discerning because this place should not have 4.5 stars. That's rid not oh, this meal didn't have 4.5. I'm rating my meal a two out of ten. And it does not look like these pictures. Let's look at some of these reviews. On Foursquare, they have a 7.5 out of 10. That's a little bit more reasonable. Oh my God, so many five star reviews. All right, let's look at these reviews. Newest descending. Because you know, sometimes places have a great reputation from like two years ago, but then maybe it's bad now, but it would just, it wouldn't have gone down. The newest review is from a local guide like me. Great food, great service, needed something greasy, and this hit the spot. It wasn't even that greasy, honestly. Grease would have helped the flavor. Let's see. Oh, here's three stars. This is another. This must be from oh, three days ago. And there's pictures, it's legit. The service was pretty slow for a party of six, three adults and three children. The food was good, but every different food component had a different temperature. Mine, too. To be fair, I would have to visit this location again. Go to check together or something. I don't know what they're talking about. That's closer to what I feel, three out of five. I'm giving this place a two out of five, though, when I review it. Here's another five star, a four star, a five star, a five star. Great food, great service, telling all my family and friends. I must be in the wrong location, because I don't feel this way. All right, all right, I'm really leaving this time. <laughs> Hold on, Molly's going off on the host. He was not enjoyable. Oh my God, just like so annoying and like thought he was the shit. Definitely. Looked like he didn't brush his teeth. Definitely has not been to the dentist like, this, this year. Maybe not next year. Thought he was so Last tough, year. so annoying. He just irked me. I was tired of hearing his voice and looking at his face. Also, like we had to hear him and see him the whole time because he was right there. Well, we I don't shout the across the stand. restaurant. I'm better than that. I don't shout across the restaurant. He's like, bro. It's not that serious. No one gives a